All right, another thing I wanna talk about, more on the food part of the food and fitness month we're going through, is easy portion control, okay? Don't go away, it's easier than you think. Don't be afraid, okay? So this concept comes from um, a book and a nutrition guidance, thought process, whatever you call it, wanna call it, it's Whole30, okay? I learned a lot of this stuff by reading the book called It Starts With Food. So if you want a good read, go ahead and do that. But let me give you some basic concepts here. So when we look at a pretty good plate, okay? It's a very large plate, maybe <laughs> make it smaller. But um, when we look at eating, there's a few things that I want you guys to keep in mind, okay? Kind of a hierarchy, perhaps, of what you should think about when you're eating. And it helps me try to figure out, okay, I want a snack, what do I eat? Or I want lunch, what do I eat, okay? So first thing I recommend is try to eat some veggies, okay? I like green veggies, that's a good idea, like salad or kale, snap peas, I like those. I also like spinach, lots of spinach, that's good. But if we can fill our plate with veggies first, that's gonna help fill you up, okay? Now the second thing, okay, what about your proteins? Proteins are good, they have good fats in them, so chicken, fish, beef, I like wild game, so like venison or elk or things like that. Fill your next portion or your next thing you're gonna eat with some protein. Um, your hand size, that's a good portion control for protein, don't do anything bigger than your hand unless you're splurging or celebrating an anniversary or something, okay? Um, and then the, the last thing, okay, fruits, okay? Veggies, proteins, fruits. I like, I like that routine. So veggies and fruits, a couple servings each meal, that's gonna satisfy you. Fruits, I do last because hopefully veggies and the proteins fill you up, but if you need something sweet, how about some berries, like a couple handfuls of berries. That's a super easy thing to do. Um, I'm going to talk about fats as well. Um, you know, cooking with fats, vegetable or not vegetable oils, avoid those, but like olive oils and things like that, that's good. I like ghee or butter, depending on your sensitivities, that's another thing you can do. But don't be afraid of having some whole fat cottage cheese or yogurt. Just watch that because this is calorie dense, and if you want to lose weight, might not want to fill your plate up with fats and fruits because that's going to help you gain weight. So it all depends on what your goals are, but when I'm prioritizing my meals, I think veggies, proteins, fruits, okay? So if you have any questions about this, this is a huge topic. I just want you to understand that there's some basic ideas that you guys can follow. So talk to your doctors or IP coach about what to do specifically for what you want to accomplish, okay? Thank you.